waited for a few things to arrive in, over the last couple of weeks. Uh, I know what this one's going to be. This one is a bit of a mystery because I do have a tendency of buying stuff and then forgetting, but it's from Japan. Uh, this one's actually from the US. And I do my best to ensure all of my cartridges or games um, are in plastic sleeves. Now in Australia, none of the current um, video game box protector companies uh, do Famicom or Super Famicom box protectors. So I actually have to pay a hell of a lot in freight to get these for the Super Famicom. Uh, and I will put a link in the video. So that's just 10 of the uh, Super Famicom ones. And they put a little sticker in there, which is really cool. So I am happy about that. These are to protect the games that I've uh, just recently purchased while in our on our holiday, like when we were in Japan. So I am looking forward to doing a video on um, finally using those games. I've been holding off until I got some protectors so I could do a video all at once. So now that those have arrived, um, I'm pretty happy about that. This one is from Japan. Not sure. Still boxed again. Yeah, I thought it was a little bit bigger than what it should be, but I do order things sometimes and then forget. Ah, awesome. I'm excited about this. This is Hattress. It is a, a Famicom game, and I believe it's Tetris, but hats. Uh, as soon as I found out about this game, I did want to get a copy of it. So um, yeah, I'm pretty happy I got this. So this is my recent pickups and I'll be doing some unboxings of the Super Famicom games that I got and putting them in uh, these new sleeves.